Okay, so you know how your phone dies and you go hunting for a charger? Well, astronauts don't have wall sockets floating around in space, but guess what? There's a way to charge a spacecraft without fuel, without solar panels, and without annoying that one friend who never returns your charger. Imagine standing on the edge of possibility, looking down on Earth as it spins quietly in the vastness of space. Up here, every watt of energy is precious. While we're used to plugging in our devices and never thinking twice, astronauts and engineers have to get creative. The question is, how do you keep a spacecraft powered when there are no outlets and sometimes not even enough sunlight? Enter the remarkable invention known as the space tether. It's called a space tether, basically, a long conductive cable hanging off a spacecraft. As the spacecraft orbits Earth, it cuts through our planet's magnetic field. And here's the cool part. Moving a conductor through a magnetic field makes electricity. It's the same trick behind wind turbines and generators, just on a giant space scale. So, in a way, the satellite is literally surfing Earth's magnetism and turning that ride into power. Think of Earth's magnetic field like invisible spaghetti strands all around the planet. The tether slices through those strands, pushing electrons along the cable. Those electrons? They become usable power, no sunlight required, and no fuel tanks needed. It's like free charging, courtesy of planet Earth. This power can run spacecraft systems or even slow down satellites so they safely fall back to Earth. Like giving them a polite nudge to retire. So yeah, it's not sci-fi, it's real science. Space tethers, turning the entire planet into the biggest power bank ever. And no, you can't plug your phone into it. Sorry.